I'm so excited about making my portrait. I've got all the things I need. I have my portrait, my background, I've got my translation sheet, some equipment, I've got my book, I've just, I've just got everything. So much stuff. Wait a minute, wait a minute. I think I need a plan. Session I will be working on. Hmm, let's see. I think I'm going to draw the objects into my background. It's really important that for this session I just focus on one thing because there's just too much stuff. So I think the first thing is that I only have the equipment I need. To draw the objects in my background, I'm going to need my portrait and my background. If I have extra images, I'm going to need those too. Or maybe my translation sheet. I can just put them to the side. These here. I'm not going to need all this equipment yet. That's probably for next session. Actually, I don't really need my book either. It'll create more space. But before I put it away, I do need to know what my target level is for this task. Hmm, let's see. I'm working on a level six. So this point here links to my background. So for this task, I need to make sure that my background composition fits around my portrait. So now I have a plan for the lesson. I have a target to work towards. And once I put my book back in the book box, I've got a really good plan for this background. But I think my portrait is too big. So one thing that I can do is I can fold away the bottom. I'll cut that off later. To start my portrait then, the best thing is to know where my face is going to go. So I'm just going to draw lightly around the then I can put my portrait away as well. <laughs> so, I've got my portrait out and I've got the images for my background. Hmm. I need to make sure that this composition fits around my portrait. So I'm going to have to fill all of this space. I can repeat my objects because I need to make sure that my composition fits. But it doesn't need to be the same thing over and over. I can change the position and the scale of it. Hmm. It's important that I use these images to get some good accuracy. Hmm. I might need to fix this. This is going to take a while if I want to get it really right. So good luck with whatever task you choose. <laughs>